Um, as a chiropractor, I often get questions about how to sleep, what's the right position, posture. Uh, the two right answers are sleeping on your back or sleeping on your side. What you want to keep in mind for those, sleeping on your back number one, is you want to make sure your pillow doesn't push your head forward. A lot of pillows now have curves in the neck, so they're ergonomic pillows, which is really good to support the neck. And then sleeping on your back, you also want to put a pillow under your knees to help the lower back stay as neutral as possible. So I'll show you an example of that. This pillow is the one that I use, and you can see there's a nice curve for the neck here. Like this. It's very, very comfortable. I sleep on my side personally, and uh, for side sleeping, you want to make sure whatever pillow you're using is not too small, um, as it will cause your head to tilt like this. So you could use two pillows depending on the size, or the one that I use is actually measured, so you measure your shoulders and it's the right width for that person. On your side, you also want to put a pillow between your knees, and that keeps the hips neutral from the side. So I'll show you that one as well. And I put my hand just under the pillow, like this. Some people sleep with their hand all the way up and that can cause shoulder issues, but just as neutral as possible like this. The last thing I want to talk about is stomach sleeping, which a lot of people do, uh, but it's very hard on the spine and on the neck. So the easiest way to get out of that is to start with side sleeping. And when I was learning not to sleep on my stomach, I used a body pillow, it was actually a bit longer than this, and I used it as something to hug. It actually is a physical barrier, so you can't roll on your stomach as well. So between the knees here, pillow up here, and you still get that comfort you almost need when you sleep on your stomach with the pillow. So there you have it. Those are my, my sleeping tips. Sleep well.